Nanumanga or Nanumaga is a reef island and a district of the Oceanian island nation of Tuvalu. It has a surface area of about 3 square kilometers with a population of 491. On May 9, 1824 a French government expedition under Captain Louis Isidore Dupere of the ship La Coquille sighted Nanumaga. The U.S. exploring expedition visited in 1841. Louis Beck, who later became a writer, became the resident trader for the Liverpool firm of John S. DeWolf & Company. On Nanumaga from about April 1880 until the trading station was destroyed later that year in a cyclone. Beck later wrote the Rangers of the Tia Cow that describes a shark attack at the Tia Cow Reef between Nanumea and Nanumaga. The population of Nanumaga from 1860 to 1900 is estimated to be between 300 to 335 people. Nanumaga Post Office opened around 1925. In 1986 it became a center of debate when Pacific archaeologists discovered the submerged caves of Nanumanga, and found what they argued was the remains of fire created by prehistoric inhabitants. The Nanumaga landscape consists of the main village settlements of Tonga and Tokelau, the two main pits for swamp taro. The mangrove forests surrounding the internal lagoons and the areas of general vegetation which includes coconuts, pandanus trees and other vegetation types. The island has an oval outline, with a longer axis oriented north-south. A fringing reef surrounds the whole island, which makes local fishing and transport into and out of the island difficult. There are two brackish water lagoons, the largest, Veatoa, having four islands. Veatoa Lagoon is located in the north of the island while the smaller Hopai Lagoon is in the south. A causeway has been constructed to the south of Veatoa Lagoon linking the village areas of Tonga and Mate Matfaga. There are mangrove trees, native broadleaf forest and coconut palms. The two recorded mangrove species in Tuvalu are the common togo and the red-flowered mangrove segale. The mangrove forest of the northern Veatoa Lagoon covers an area approximately 20 hectares. Nanumaga has a locally managed marine area, which encompasses the entire island. Spear fishing is also totally banned on the reef and, no fishing is allowed on the reef on the western side of the island, except handlining. Spear fishing is also totally banned on the island. A seamount located just off the northern tip of the island is an important key fishing ground, which has been declared a no-anchor zone. In March 2015 Nanumaga suffered damage to houses, crops and infrastructure as the result of storm surges caused by Cyclone Pam. 60 to 100 houses were flooded and the health facility suffered damage. At the 2012 census the population of the villages was, the junior school is Lotahoni Primary School. There are a few paths and unpaved roads. There are no airports, so everything goes in and out by boat. There is an unprotected 10 meters wide boat channel that cuts into the fringing reef. The boat landing is where passengers and cargo is landed from the inner island ferry workboats. Nanumanga is one of the eight constituencies in Tuvalu, and elects two members of parliament. Following the 2019 general election, Manai's Lafai was returned to parliament and Minitalapati Taupo was elected to parliament. In 2016 the Tuvalu National Council for Women worked with the Green Climate Fund to enable women from the islands of Nanumea and Nanumaga to be part of talks about climate crisis. One of their key issues was the additional burden of social care than women take on in the aftermath of natural disasters. Otinia Lutausi was the Deputy Prime Minister in the government of Kamuta Latasi, Deputy Prime Minister and Minister for Natural Resources and also the Home Affairs and Rural Development in the second government of Baiknibu Piniu. He served as the Speaker of the Parliament of Tuvalu from 2003 until 2006, then again from March 2014 until he was not re-elected to Parliament in the general election held on September 9, 2019. Tau Lapua Lapua is a Tuvaluan Olympic weightlifter. At the 2013 Pacific Mini Games, Tau Lapua Lapua won Tuvalu's first ever gold medal in major sporting competition in the men's 62kg snatch. Thanks for watching.